Hi kids! Today we will learn what are 2D and 3D shapes. Let's start! Kids, can you put anything in this shape? Think. No, you cannot put anything in this shape. So, such shapes where you cannot put anything in them are 2D shapes. They are so called because they have only two dimensions, that is, breadth and length. So, what have we learned? We have learned that 2D shapes are those shapes where we cannot put anything in them. And they have only two dimensions, length and breadth. Good. Kids, can you put anything in this shape? Yes, you can put something in this shape. So, such shapes where you can put something in them are called 3D shapes. And they are so called because... Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects. They have three dimensions. One more dimension than 2D shape. Have a look. It has depth also. So, 3D shapes are those in which we can put something in them. And they are so called because they have three dimensions. Length, breadth, and depth or height. Here we have a picture. Is it a 2D shape or a 3D shape? This shape has three dimensions. It has length, breadth, and height too. So it's a 3D shape. Here we have another shape. Is it a 2D shape or a 3D shape? This shape has only two dimensions, length and breadth, no height. So it's a 2D shape. Here we have another object. Now we have to tell, is it a 2D object or a 3D object? Can we put something in this object? Yes. And how many dimensions does it have? It has length, it has breadth, and it has height too. So it's 3D object. Now we have one more object. We have to tell that, is it a 2D object or a 3D object? Can we put something in this object? Yes, we can put something in this object. How many dimensions does it have? It has length, breadth, and height. So it's a 3D object. Now one more object. We have to tell that, is it a 2D object or a 3D object? It's a paper. This object has only two dimensions, length and breadth. And also we cannot put something in this object. So it's a 2D object. So kids, today we learned what are 2D and 3D shapes. Now you may go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye!